Hey everybody, it's Mike here. Welcome to the channel and welcome to a new video in 3D Coat. Well, one of the things you need to know when you start modeling and or sculpting is how to load up a reference image because that is something we often do. It can be very helpful and it's a kind of neat to know how, right? So uh, yeah, you can do that in 3D Coat as well. Uh, I'm gonna jump into the voxel sculpting room to demonstrate it, but um, you can do it in a modeling room as well, right? So we've got the voxel sculpting room. I'm just gonna click on an open grid here. What you're gonna do is you're gonna hover your mouse to the top right corner until this vertical menu shows up here, okay? And then on this menu, you're gonna take the top icon where it shows a camera. Now, when you click on that, you get a whole bunch of options. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna go and look for background, then go to the left and look for reference image four, and then you choose the axes you want to use, X, Y, or Z. And you can actually use all three if you want, if you've got multiple images, right? I'm going to click on this one, and then I am directed to my desktop, and you can choose the folder where your file is. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab, let's say, this image right here, okay? It will load up, as you can see. From here, I can go in and I can move it around if I want. I can scale it if I want. It's all good, right? Okay, cool. Now, from here, what I can do is uh, just start to sculpt, right? So I can go in here, grab a sphere, and start doing my thing. And as soon as I do that, you see that the controls around the reference image are now gone, right? And I can go in here and try to select it, but I can't, so it's not in your way, okay? Well, that's all there's to it. It's a very simple process, so, which is good, I guess. Uh, so that's it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. See you in the next one. Bye. Well, thanks for watching. And before you go, please hit that MH button to subscribe, okay? See you guys next time. Bye.